Good evening. I'm State Senate Deputy Leader Mike Gianaris. Sorry I couldn't be with you tonight to celebrate my favorite cultural institution, the Museum of the Moving Image, but I had to take a moment to express my gratitude to you all. I'm proud to be part of a community like ours that embraces the arts, and the anchor of that cultural experience is the Museum of the Moving Image. This summer, thousands of New York students will come to the museum, learning how to be the creators of tomorrow as part of summer media camps. Only here can you see big screen blockbusters as well as learn more about independent filmmakers like Jose Valdeomar in the Cinema of Sensations exhibit. This is why I was proud to secure $5 million in funding for the Museum of the Moving Image and why I'll continue to support this beloved institution. Tonight, the museum once again brings Hollywood to Astoria and uplifts homegrown filmmakers. I'm so pleased we can honor John Wilson and Michael J. Fox both of whom have impacted the world in profound ways. John has taken audiences on his first person journey through New York, proudly displaying the colorful, creative, and kooky sides of the city we all call home. He's taken us along on his own journey of learning about his city and himself and the charming How To with John Wilson. And Michael J. Fox is of course a living legend. From Alex P. Keaton to Marty McFly to Mike Flaherty, he's brought incredible characters to life on screen. More importantly, he has been a powerful voice off screen in his personal fight and public advocacy around Parkinson's disease. In the true role of a lifetime, Michael J. Fox tells his own story in Still, now streaming on Apple TV+. His strength of character is as formidable as his talent, and I am proud to join the Museum of the Moving Image in saluting Michael J. Fox. Please keep up the great work. The world needs you all now more than ever. Thank you, and have a wonderful evening.